give this a go. We're flying the, we fly the F two A one Buffalo. Yep. Two machine guns. Also right. known as the Brewster Buffalo. That right. was the company that made it. A pig of a plane to fly, but not very popular during the war. Then okay. again, what was? <laughs> a difficulty level, realistic. We've got, we've got difficult, uh, different difficulty. We've got simplified, simulator, realistic. I'm going to go for realistic. Nice middle of the road, because I'm not clever enough to do uh, the simulator one. we will probably have to worry about all sorts of different things. Yep. And some nice pictures uh, in black and white grainy shots there. Nice. Uh, there's somebody on the throttle there. Nice. Nice. Plane in the air. Got you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right. Oh. Get some posh bloke telling you what to do on these later ones. Mm -hmm. Let's get going indeed. Uh, right, you can listen to these, this guy prattle on if you want. He sounds very uh, British for being an American plane, yep. but you know. And I think we're actually flying over Pearl Harbor, so you might see some nice uh, Pacific terrain today. Okay. Right, right here we go. Right, so in ascend and descend, that's nice, yeah. that's always handy in the plane. That's uh, W and S, that's nice. This seems a bit advanced to be honest, I never really touched these buttons in flight. Um, well you don't need to really, because no, really. the majority of it's come. If you want to do a tight turn, he'll, he'll show you on this, if you want to do a tight turn you can often turn on your side and then pull, pull it back and do a nice tight turn if you're in a bit of a scrape. But really, you can do all that on the mouse anyway. So it just makes it more like a first-person shooter than a flight simulator. So you get the best of all worlds. Yeah. These are the kind of controls that I have to use because, uh, like I say, I've, I can't get my head around like, avionics anyway. Yeah, that's <laughs> so it, right? Like. I'm just, uh, I'm literally just, I play this thing in, in my pants and my, in my yeah. boxer shorts. <laughs> right, Q and E. There you go. You see the little tail moving there. Nice. Yay! All right. Give the folks a wave. Okay. So, here we go, take off. We go. Ready? Right, pull the foot low. Right. So, right. shift. Cover this before. And here we go. Start off with a canny rate of knots. You can use a QA, and e but we're kind of aiming right down the, the runway, so we don't want to mess with that, or else I'll end up finding them hanging on the right hand side there and giving somebody a, a wake up call. Giving someone a bad day. Right. I mean, I think these boys got a tighter Pearl Harbor anyway, so we can do that with flying through and smashing them. You know? <laughs> right, and here we go. And use the S. Like I say, I don't really need to because you can do that on the mouse. Okay. It's more nice gentle to do it on the mouse anyway, it's more yeah. fine tuned. If anything, you can tip the wings, do a quick barrel roll, but I think it tells you how to do that later. So, climb roughly around about 250 feet now, 275 mile an hour. And thought was that full ball. Let's give it a bit more willy. 275 kilometres an hour, not mile an hour. <laughs> kilometres, is it? Aye, yeah. Oh, right, aye. Sorry, yeah. As it, would be, it would be quite fast for a prop. <laughs> like a bit cutscene. Yay, barrel roll. That's me instructed, by the way. That was me doing it. Yeah. Right, it's that my turn now. Don't have to, but do it anyway. Yay, I it's like fun. Roll. That'll do it, mate. That's been sucked off somewhere else. Right, okay, so we'll try that. Eh? Yep. Don't use the rudder. Yep. Not for sharp turns. You can probably rip it off actually, the D's and that and all that kind right. of stuff. All the physics, that's, <laughs> that's way above my head. Right. Like I say, I'll just stick in the uh, Call of Duty style point, click, shoot, and kill death thing. I'd like to say, the, the controls are. Uh, uh, look at that, that's, look at the solar flare, that's nice. Lovely. Though. It's a really smart looking game, I mean look at the terrain that you're flying over. They've, they've taken a lot of time mm. making this game look as sharp as it needs to be. Even the, sh the shininess of the plane impresses me quite a bit as well. Yeah. Okay, so we'll decrease the throttle now, as instructed. Oh, don't want to... <laughs> not, not that far. <laughs> don't want to turn the engine off. Right, increase the throttle about 80, go and make your mind up, fella. There we go. The controls, like I say, take some getting used to. Um, before we go into a battle, I'll quickly show you how to actually bring up the test flight thing. We'll not do a test flight because it's a bit boring. 
Mm-hmm. Uh, we'll just get straight into a fight after this because no doubt you're probably getting bored already with all this instruction being fired at you. Mm-hmm. Continue increasing the claim throttle. Yeah, when it says whip on the throttle thing, that just means you, you've engaged your afterburner and you're going up the full speed ahead. Yeah. If you, in case you need a bit of a boost to get out of combat or nice get a bit of elevation. There. This is okay. sharp banking, if you want to do a sharp bank. Oh, oh. get a bit there. So you bank sharp and then pull down. Yeah, it's just if you want to bank yeah. quite sharp. That'll be handy for getting away from enemy fire. It's probably why I keep getting shot down. Mind you, like I say, the first planes that you're flying is basically just a big drum. Yep. <laughs> it's made of like wood and taut yeah, material. Yeah, just, just paper and string really, so. Use the elevator to complete your combat manoeuvre. Okay. There we go, pull the mouse around as well. And That's there it. we go, mission complete. I think he was pulling so much that the J's there were starting to make them black out. Mm-hmm. Don't want to be blacking out. Mm-hmm. Or else, like Molly eloquently put it yesterday, you end up floating down to earth with everyone machine gun <laughs> you. So. Yeah. <laughs> so, right, proceed de- along the designated route. I'm sure we can do this. Yeah. Here we go. Get yourself up the full speed ahead, eh? Let's get some, uh, let's get some boost on this. You don't get planes that sound like this anymore, do you? No. Nah. It's a golden age of flight. Uh, and through this one. Right, where's the next one? Showing up with a mini map there. On the top right hand corner. Well, I'm not too sure if the uh, map's are geogra- geographically correct, but it uh, looks like a very nice place, Pearl Harbor. Yep. Nice and pretty to look at while you're flying about. Ah, yeah. Not even looking at it much anyway, you're particularly nah. looking at the guy trying yeah. to kill you. That's it. Oh, oh, sharp oh, turn. See, oh, sharp turn. Blacked out again. Um, Some welly. That's it. That's a bit of the root off this bastard. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's not blow the engine away. No. It'll be embarrassing if I fail the tutorial. But on the tutorial, right. you can push your you can push your plane as hard as you like. It, in the real game, your, your engine will cut out, but on this, you can give it some welly, and it, it never ever cuts out. It's just it's just being easy on you really. Yeah. You've all, I think you've also got fuel in the real game that you need to worry about as well. So yeah. if you it depends. If you push it hard, it's usually about forty five minutes worth of fuel, so if you push it hard you might run out. And if you're on for a long time, but usually you're not on for you're never on with one plane for forty five minutes. If you are you're very good. Yeah, I'm gonna say you're good if you are. <laughs> Either that or you're in the totally the wrong place. <laughs> aye, aye. <laughs> but Okay, aerial combat and landing, let's give this a go. Hopefully I don't embarrass myself on this one. F2A1 Buffalo. Yeah, throws the Buffalo again, nice and quick. And we'll go for realistic on this one as well. No doubt it'll be a cutscene at the start of this one as well. Oh, look, more greeny black and white photographs. They're probably telling us things that clever people should yeah. know. Put your whales up, it's telling us. Um, how about the land? <laughs> yeah. We'll have a go at that, eh? Hey? Oh, it shouldn't be that easy. Right, I think one press space and skip this guy, like say you're more welcome to listen to him. Mm-hmm. Uh, but we'll just bash on with this mm-hmm. and get this over and done with. Test with different view systems. Yeah. It's just having explaining the V button a bit more. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we'll have a switch between some of the nice views. There we are in the cockpit there. This will be for all of you uh, flight sim fans out there. No doubt this, the guys have probably taken the time to actually make this uh, as accurate as possible. So mm-hmm. it's nice to have a duck in every now and then and just. Uh, Yep. Appreciate the, the hard work these boys put in. Different view, right? We've got some kind of avionic. Yeah. Kind of That's just a dis- display for your heads. Your heads up display view. If you want to stick stick on that. But I think we'll go back to yeah. a nice simple third person view. I like to see the plane. Miss the beauty if you don't have if you just have a crap view on anyway. So. Yeah. All right. Give it some welly. Give it some speed. Right. Let's jack this up. <clears throat> yeah. You can zoom in with a Z. With a Z. Zoom. You an idea what what you're flying towards? Okay, and so let's press the hold and save button and have a look around my plane. Oh yeah, nice day. This just like checks that. for bandits on your tail. This one does. Just That's the case. Okay, so where am I looking at? Test different view systems. Yeah, it's just showing you how to use it really again. 
to inject it complete. Right, so now it looks like we're going to be shooting these things down. So this should be good. Uh, we'll skip the nice little cinematic there they put in for us. No doubt it's unpacked. We'll watch this because we're probably going to shoot something down there. There we go. Get on. Get on! Yeah! <laughs> yeah. And it doesn't... I don't think we'll be fighting too many barrage balloons in the actual no. game. But... You never know. But do be warned, you can embarrassingly smash into them on this Master tutorial. Them. Master the main fight skills. Now this is what I'm... This is what we signed up for, isn't it? Yeah. Not got to the left one, maybe. Please. Okay. That's very nice. Can right. I shoot this thing yet? Yep. Go for it. Right. Fire. Keep firing. There we go. Keep shooting. There we go. And that's that one destroyed. You're a bit close to him there. Go straight in. Okay. Like I say, you might bong into him so if not. So middle mouse button. Let's give it a go. Let's give it a go. Boom. There you go. So right. we might be able to get these in one it. Let's give it a go. Right, so that's in there. Oh, where am I now? Oh, oh, oh! Right, let's get him. Just fire. <laughs> shoot, shoot, shoot. Right. Next uh, one. Next one. Are we going to get this boy from this range? Of course we are. I see, I'm at uh, half throttle here, just trying to make it easy on myself, but obviously you'll be probably fighting at full throttle, yeah. no doubt. It does help if you turn your throttle down a bit when you're engaged in combat, to keep it going up and down, so if someone runs away from you, you can always boost the throttle up to, up to full, put a stick a bit after burner on, just to get them chased down. I mean, it doesn't happen when you're at the start of the game, because you're in the bloody biplanes anyway, so anything you try and chase is probably going to run. Yeah. But, you're basically in a kite. Yeah. <laughs> Like I said, there's paper and string. Did you ever see them box kites? Aye. How the, how the, how the bloody hell do they fly? Oh, no idea, mate. Like I said, it's a game. That's another idea for people who know about aeronautics, I think. But mm -hmm. Also right. on this tutorial, you can have a bit of a bash at the rest of these barrage balloons as well, if you if you fancy. We'll not, I, we'll not bore you with it. I will leave you with that now. You can have a good laugh at me trying to land this thing. Obviously, I don't think you want to be landing at full ball, so... Uh, you might want to come off the beans a little bit. <laughs> right. No doubt they'll probably talk us through that anyway. Yeah. Fully explains it on the way down. So we'll just bash on to this checkpoint here and see what he's gonna. What you... I'm gonna call him Biggles. Biggles, hi. Oh, it Biggles. suits him. Uh, man, you're gonna fly an RAF later. We're gonna talk to each other in RAF voices. Oh, really? What hell, Jeff? Tell you how Chalks away. The damn Jerry's is on the case again. Bring me back a Nazi with real hair. <laughs> Right, so, come on, Steve, fine, come on. Like I say, the tutorials can get a bit boring. It's like you say, it's a lot of flying about, getting in line, getting yourself positioned properly to land and trying not to twat your landing gear straight off your plane while you do it. Right, so but, here we are. I think there's a landing field strip over there, so we'll be making yeah. a, a bash at that. Well, yeah. Right, right so you engage the landing gear. It explains all this as you're going through it as well, so you can watch the cutscene, but he still explains it. Which is probably what I'll be doing. Yep. <laughs> Should we just bash on? Let's get on yeah. with this. Let's get on with this. Right, here we go, here we go. Okay. You actually get this in game mind. No. <laughs> and plus you've also got people shooting at you because uh, one of the thing, uh, one of the games I have played is you actually have to ca capture bases and you do that by landing on the runway. 
and oh, that's fun. <laughs> Good luck with that one. Like, especially when, like I say, you're flying some kind of like biplane, a biplane, which is basically the next step up from the flop, flop, uh, the stop with camel. Mm -hmm. So we're going to about eighty percent. One pad four. Yeah, okay. just if you want to see it your side, oh, oh, sitting you off course a bit. You're probably best off pressing the C button if you want to look at where you're going. Yeah, it keeps you. Okay, so we're dropping the landing gear now. Which is G. There we go. There we go. Gears down. And number part four to appreciate position. There we go. It's five, five to get five back. To get yeah. back. Bit of dramatic music just to make you right. more nervous than you are. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Right, should I be lowering my speed a bit more, do you think? You can tell you when to, I think. Uh, let's do this by the numbers, eh? There we go. Oh. So we'll drop him down to about 50. I'll do 48 then. I don't think he's overly bothered about yeah, it. No, it's not an exact science, I don't think. Okay, so this is it. Final approach. <gasps> Wish me luck, chaps. <laughs> and chapettes. And whoever's in between. Straighten yourself out a bit. Straighten yourself out a bit. On the runway. Here we go. Here we go. I think the Here trick is to try and stop it at the end, really. <laughs> That's the trick. Yeah. We're coming down here. He says about 30. No, don't we'll probably tell us soon. We've got to do around about 30%. There you go. Yeah. Put that down a bit. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Let's try not to stall it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, don't shut your engine off. No, not quite yet. Okay. I'll just use your mouse. <laughs> it says to use S, but. Okay. I'm gonna hit. Uh, I'm gonna hit the plane here. Oh, I wanna hit Drake. I wanna hit Drake. I wanna hit Drake. Oh, <laughs> oh well. Oh well. We'll that's, try this one again. That's exactly how you don't do it. Okay. Press PS bar to continue. Yeah. And you. Oh, we'll start again, Michael. We'll just walk through this one then. Yeah. You say speed up. <laughs> I just put trees on the approach to a <laughs> friggin' runway. You would have thought they'd cleared them, like, but you know. Uh, aye, In the really, real world, they might have. There's a convoy going out there, and bottom, bottom right hand screen there. Oh, yeah. Got any bombs to drop? <laughs> <laughs> Happy sailing to you, boys. For those in peril on the sea and all that. It would have been crap being, like, a, like. Put anything in the water. Like, <laughs> anything in the water. Like, yeah. in the wall. Especially, like, a sailor. Yeah. But uh, just basically anything during the war. I didn't fancy getting filled, putting a tin, tin can and shot at 300 miles an hour into the air. Machine yeah. gun fire firing at us the whole time. I wouldn't thank you for that. I think I'll just stick with a day job. Right, well, it's in decreased to 80, but I'm going to try and get this over. I'm getting a bit cocky you now, which is probably <laughs> going to be the end of it. Yeah, we'll probably not do it this time neither, but we'll give it a go. If we don't do it this time, we'll just skip on to the next. <laughs> no. I... Don't need to land anyway. Aye. Right, drop your gear. Down, down. Oh, yeah, put your, probably put your speed down now, will we? Aye. We don't want to land full ball. No. Right, okay. Let's get round here through this hoop. How do you, how do you suppose the float of these hoops from your tutorial? I oh, have no idea. Helium, do you think? Jedi mind tricks, I think. No. Witchcraft. No. Right. Voodoo. Force. Witchcraft. Okay, yeah, yeah, let's bash on with this. If I crash again, feel free to skip through the video. I'll probably skip through the video anyway and get the basics anyway. Alright. But uh, we'll keep bashing on the Same decrease your throttle again, mind. Alright. Okay. 50, I think. Yeah, whatever. Mm, stay at 70 a bit longer. Alright. For pansies, will you? For yeah, pansies. pansies, yeah. <laughs> For people who actually know what they're doing. Yeah. Go on, right. decrease them. <laughs> decrease. God's sake. God's sake. Right. Okay, we'll drop it down. We'll drop it down. We'll about 30 now. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. Right. Right. Airspeed's still with high. Just, just pull up a little bit. Alright, decrease. Let's sort of try not to into a palm tree again if we can possibly avoid it. Yes, right, we'll miss the palm trees this time. Palm trees and planes don't miss. Yep. We'll learn that last time. Right. Don't. We'll have a bit of better angle this time. I think it was a bit low last time. Just kind of yep. scaring the cows and waiting up the farmers. Oops. Yeah, I think you've got it this time. Okay, so hopefully I should have it this time. Right, throttle off. Okay. You're bouncing mind. Okay. I might have came in a bit too fast. Okay, and I'm throttling all the way back to get my break. And yep. this could be it. There we go. Woohoo! <laughs> hey! Hey! Second time's a job. Yeah, second time's a job. Yeah, I'd say so. Honestly, mate, I think the hardest part is getting shot at. Yeah, aye. 
Doing that whilst getting shot at. Yeah, Biggles. You're wrong. <laughs> what do you know? You're in the wrong bloody place anyway. You're in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Aye. So, yeah. I haven't done that one before, so there you can see. I've got my reward there. I've got my fi uh, 5,000 silver lines for 5, that one. Silver. If I had a premium account, I'd have got 7,500. Uh, 7, I don't have a premium account, but you can buy a premium account using your gold. Mm -hmm. But uh, I might do that later. I think you pay about 100, 100 gold for a day account. That's 24 hours exactly. So just use it when you go. Use it when you know you're gonna play. 